the swing dancer is it is myself, talented Miss Stephanie by my side. As always, we are going to show you a little sequence we put together for our weekly Thursday class here at Nick's. Now, over the past year, Stephanie, I've been doing a lot of moves that are lean follow. Some are more advanced, some are not, but some fall into the category of more choreographed. So if you have a partner that you were with all the time when you're doing a competition or you just want to do something where you two have it all to yourself, this is a great move. If you don't have a steady partner, show it to him first. This is a cool move, but it's really hard to lead and follow, at least at the beginning. Just want to give a little note starting. After should push. Ladies, your footwork is the same as a whip count. One turning two, she does coaster three and four. So one, two, coaster, step. Weight on her right foot. I haven't done my part, I just want to make sure everyone sees her part. So we're just going to go front to back, bring her in. One, two, three, weight her right foot. Okay, what I'm doing is as she's doing one to move off the track, I go one, two, switch hands as I turn her, then I back up four, three, and four, pick up her left. So going a little bit quicker, just that part. I go one, two, three, four, five, and six, one, two, three, and four. Weighted on my left, weighted on Stephanie's right. Coming forward, you want to pull her up onto that right foot. Then from there, this is where it changes. The next count is and five, six. So that energy has to change for the count. Sugar push here, three and four, five and six, one, two, three and four, and five, six. Now there's a lot going on there. For the ladies, this is what you have to do. So we're gonna get to four, one, two, three and four, and five, she's gonna turn. And five, weighted on her right foot. Six is going to be a tap, not with the weight on it, but attack. And I'm going to put my right hand on her right hip in a professional, be creepy way. But you want to have that hand there for what's coming up. So that's her footwork. So what I have to do is one, two, three, and four. Now, Stephanie doesn't stay there. I'm going to go and five. So I'm just taking one step for two beats and five. And then I tap my left foot out to the side on six. So both of us are on her footwork. Weighted on our right feet, but our left foot is being the sixth count. I know. That's why we're recording. Two, three, and four. Five, and six. One, two, three, and four. And five, six. Okay, from there, we struck. We did three for the class. You can do more if you want. So we're just going to be beside each other just to show you how to do that. Our weighted on our right foot, as with her, but this is six. You're going to take a step on that left foot, both of you forward, for seven and eight. Eight is a tap. Then you just repeat it. Nine and ten. Repeat it. Eleven and twelve. So, a little bit faster without us doing it together. So this is six. It's seven and eight. Nine and ten. Eleven and twelve. Still on her footwork. So whole way through, sugar push, three and four, five and six, one, two, three and four, and five, six, seven and eight, nine and ten, eleven, twelve. Now I'm holding her left hand with mine and making her go down the track. I'm giving her a push, okay? Just front to back so you can see that part. One, two, three, and four. And five, six, we strut, we strut, we strut. Now you're not really seeing me so much, as much as you're looking at her, which is fine, but you both want to look together and make it smooth. So by the third one, that's a prep. So after the sugar push, three and four, five and six, one, two, three and four, and five, six, seven and eight, nine and ten, eleven and prep. Make your turn, triple, triple. While I'm doing her first triple, I'm not doing anything, Second one, I'm doing my triple to get back onto my footwork. So the whole thing, a little bit quicker. One, two, three, and four, and five, six, seven, and eight, nine, and ten, eleven, and prep, triple, I move. So I have to get back on my footwork because I had to get on hers before. Last time, whole way through, front to back. One, two, three, and four, and five, six, seven, and eight. 9 and 10, 11 and 12, triple, triple. It takes time to get that body walking with the struts. 
we kind of worked on as much as we could in class. But that's where you get the time. Once you get better at it, confidence builds, you set to your computer, your call. Thank you, my dear. Hope you like it, guys. That's never been taught before, first time ever. Hope you use it as well. So we'll have some for you next time. Until then, have a great week. Keep dancing.